So, today I thought I'd open up Gary's Mod for the first time in uh, three years and make a recording of an old project that I made using Wire Mod. So, this is a missile launcher. You can adjust the angle of it. And then, once I've picked an angle that I like, I press a button on my numpad here, and pulls back, loads a missile, and fires. Now it does this using a, an advanced duplicator paster, which you can see here. It pastes this rocket here. Uh, let's move that out of the way here. There we go. So as you can see, it has a plug, and then this plug goes to a latch, which is inside of this barrel here. Let's remove that to get a better look. And then this latch activates the main engine, as well as these two stabilizer thrusters. Now it's all built around this long wooden board so that when it blows up there's nothing left behind, though unfortunately the plugs stick around. So, when it spawns in, the plug plugs into one of these two depending on uh, what the physics engine is feeling like today. And then it receives the launch command through this gate here. So. Essentially, uh, all of this logic aside, what it does when you fire the when you press the fire button is it rotates back like so, pastes in a missile, waits a moment. Sometimes the plug gets caught on there. I'm not sure why. Anyhow, rotates back, loads a missile, then rotates back forwards, and then issues the fire command. So I can set this like that. Let's fire off another one. Alright, so that's all well and good, just demonstrating this thing. But what does it do against... Uh, what does it do for damage? Well, let's find out. Now that we know the land up here... Let's give it something to hit. So this is a 4x4 four four cube of crates, and they are all welded together. Now, let's uh, put it right... It takes a while to paste due to all those welds. There we go. Just unfreeze this. And we'll see how much leg I generate. Hmm. Let's try that again, shall we? There we go. Plenty of leg. Let's just uh, finish that thing off, huh? There we go. Let's try that again. go and fire All right, looks like my aims off by a bit let's see if we can improve that unfortunately due to uh, 
various physics related issues. It's sometimes hard to predict the There we go. Now the range on these is fairly impressive as well, um, given that they're self-propelled. They don't really ever stop until uh, well, it runs into something, right? So let's give that demonstration. most of the distance of this long map. So now if I just, uh, let's elevate that a bit more. There we go. Now if I'm too high, it'll go off the top of this map. Nope, looks like you got it dialed in just right. So there you go. That's what I did with my free time uh, about five years ago. Uh, maybe longer. Hope you enjoy.